Altion may claim to be on the side of good, but he is far from it. His villainous acts began when he committed treason by starting a rebellion against Dethrix, the ruler of Dreadhaven. During his conquest, he beat up the father of a ten-year-old and then forced that child out of their home. After Altion was wrongfully crowned king, he went on to steal Lenaria from his friend Valen. During their wedding, Dethrix attacks and kidnaps Lenaria. Valen insists that they rescue her, but Altion wants to protect the cities that are being attacked instead. Like, come on, this man wasn't even married for one second, and he's already abandoning his wife. The people in the city should be able to evacuate, so Altion is just making up excuses at this point. Anyways, let's fast forward to the present day. Lenaria is dead, and Altion has been injured by the now grown-up ten-year-old child that he exiled many years ago. From here on out, Altion is probably the most useless character we meet throughout the story. This guy does absolutely nothing. All he does is sits in his throne or lays in bed all day. This is shown when our character comes to collect Sepulchre's life insurance from Baron Bacon. He throws us in jail, and Altion does absolutely nothing to stop our imprisonment, even though he's literally sitting two feet away from us. He was also a horrible father. He allowed his youngest daughter to enslave a dragon. He wouldn't let Victoria help out, even though she was good at archery. And he showed up to his eldest daughter's wedding with an infectious disease. Not only that, he also kills her. But killing his daughter isn't even the worst thing he did. Oh no. The worst thing he did, without a doubt, was unleashing the laggiest boss in the game against us. The Chaos Dragon. After we defeat it at one frame a second, we finally get to face Altion outside of the city he just destroyed. But he was also extremely laggy. And not only that, he could also kill the entire party instantly. However, that wasn't enough to defeat us, and we were able to drive our sword through his chest, putting a stop to the Tyrant King once and for all. Altion was the true villain of this story. He took over kingdoms, betrayed his friends, and was a terrible father to his daughters. But now that he is gone, we can move past his atrocious legacy and forget that he ever existed.